A well-liked Democrat announces he is not only pulling out of the governor's race, but is also leaving Congress. We begin with that decision from the 7th District Representative Ed Perlmutter. I'm Britt Marino. Thanks for joining us. He is currently serving his fifth term. Our Jamie Leary is covering Colorado first for us and joins us live from Golden, where the congressman explained why he's leaving office. Jamie, why was it so emotional? Well, this was a surprise for many people, and he has spent many, many years in politics. And actually, he spent the time before this announcement showing me photos of his many years on the campaign trail and showing me all the volunteers that have put in so much hard work with him uh, on the campaign trail for those many, many years, talking about his family as well with me. Two of his three daughters sat mixed in with members of the media at his campaign offices this afternoon, both fighting back tears as their father formally announced that he was withdrawing from the gubernatorial race and additionally would not be seen re seeking re-election in the House in 2018. The decision, Perlmutter said, was not easy. Several times this afternoon he had to pause to collect his thoughts. He made it clear, though, he still has 18 months left as a representative for the 7th Congressional District, and he said he plans to make the most of it. Finishing the VA hospital is his top priority, as well as working on aerospace issues and marijuana issues. So he's got a lot still on tap, and he said about these, quote, I'm going to work my fanny off to get them done. As for the reason behind his decision, he said the entrance of Jared Polis into the race was going to make it tough, and a couple of weeks ago he started to realize that he couldn't do it all. I had to take a good look and see if I had enough fire in the belly or gas in the tank or whatever you want to call it uh, to get that done and win this campaign. And, you know, I had to take a good uh, realistic look at it. But it wasn't Jared. Now, he said he is not done yet. Of course, he's got those 18 months left, and the priority is going to be the people of the 7th Congressional District. He also said, watch out, because he's going to be a voter, so the people he was going to run against, they better be nice to him. So, sounds like he's not going anywhere for a while. Live in Lakewood, Jamie Leary, CBS4 News. Thank you for the insight, Jamie.